Hey guys, so I just created a plugin for my first time, so I thought I'd show you how I made it, or not actually how I made it, but why I made it. So this is my first time actually making a plugin, but honestly, I noticed I was spending like 20 minutes at a time creating or grouping up armor and stuff. So, oops, if I go into my workspace and find this model, as you can see, look at all these little armor pieces. A ton of different meshes, right? So I was like, there has to be an easier way to do this. So I wanted it to be as easy as possible in the future to add armor. So I'm like, why not just make a plugin? So I created my own plugin basically for the game called the Armor Grouper. So how you do it is you just select the Armor Grouper. And what you do is you click on this, the character model where the armor is. Click Create Group. So it splits into three sections, armit, or armit, armor, helmet, and leg. So um, what I'm going to do now is follow these directions. So it says select all the parts that belong to the head. So I'm going to find the helmet, which is the only part that actually belongs to the head. Just like that. Click Next. Now i got to find the upper torso part. So I'm just going to click through. There's the upper torso. And now it says right upper arm, so I'm going to find the right upper arm part. So this is split into an R15 model. So this will just make it easier for when I add it to my game. So right lower arm. I just created this today, so it was actually a good learning, learning experience. So right lower arm, right hand. There we go. Left upper arm. Let me extend this out a bit. Left upper arm right here. And by the way, you have to select the primary part first. That's just how I made it. Uh, got a little lazy there, but it is what it is. Left to lower arm. Left hand. Right here. Lower torso. Right. Oh, did I miss it? Clicked right through it. Right upper leg. Right there. Just gonna finish this up. Right lower leg. Right foot. So this would normally take me 20 to 25 minutes to do normally. So this makes it a lot easier on me. Oops, I actually screwed that up. I should have added the other thing first, but it's fine. Left upper leg. Left upper leg. There it is. And the lower leg right here. We're almost there. So now left foot. This is the last part. So I'm going to select the primary part first. That part. Click next. And now they're all grouped together except this one, which I accidentally missed. So let me put that in quick. So now, as you can see, they're all actually grouped inside of these. And they automatically get welded together. So if I look at my foot, you see how normally these parts wouldn't stick together, but I have the plugin automatically make the weld constraints. So then they're welded together. Primary parts, like I said, they're already set. So what I'm gonna do, because I accidentally missed this part, I'm just gonna put it back. And I'm gonna make this a primary part. And yeah, it's really that easy. It's really cool. This is primarily for my game. It's just um an easier thing to do so that's all it is you got to think about the future and how easy things are going to be in the future and that's why i actually made this plugin in the first place so just thought i'd update you guys with something interesting something cool so see ya